What's up guys, Mustang Matt here in Spin Tires. I'm sorry that I haven't posted in a few days. I've been crazy busy at work. Um, cause, you know, I have two normal jobs actually. So, I've been working a ton trying to get some money saved up. And I just haven't had as much time for YouTube as I would like to. But, I'm trying to do better. Trying to do better. So here I am. Uh, doing a, a video today in Spent Tires on this Suburban mod. Just, I, I found it and I wanted to see how it did because they're nice looking trucks, especially this generation Suburban. And this thing sounds pretty, pretty mean. It's bogging down a little bit in the mud. Through the water crossing. I find it kind of cool how I was able to get the winch and bumper on the front and the tire holder on the back. The tire holder actually looks pretty good on the Suburban. It doesn't look too bad. This truck actually does pretty good. Pretty good right here anyway. Let's see. Once I get further up. A lot of trails here. A lot of trails. Continuing on, this this map isn't quite as difficult as I thought. Pretty easy map. Gives it a good mud test and good water crossing test, but not really much else. Kind of, it bogs down a little bit, like in the mud and water crossings, but it still, it still goes through pretty good. Just a little bit slow. It takes time to go through it, but the thing is, it does it. And yeah, yeah, there may be other vehicles that does it better, but eh, this one still does it. That's. That's the fact of the matter. This thing, it does it. And it, it, it crawls right through. Alright, I kind of want to switch maps real quick. Wait. No, no, no. Main menu. That's what I wanted. Okay. Let's do... I was on the river map. Well, why don't we do flood? And then I can do, I can add that one just in case. And then I'll have to find the suburban mod again. There it is. Start new game. Hmm. Head in there. All right, actually, I don't want to be in the YJ. I want to get in the Suburban. Advanced, change truck. Why did it change the camera angle? I didn't tell it to, there we go. All right, there we go. All right, I'm wanting to go this way. Oh God, I slammed into that. That was rough. And it appears that I've gotten myself stuck already. Maybe not, maybe I can pull myself out. Maybe I can correct what I've done. Or maybe not. Yeah, I don't think there's any getting out of this. Oh my gosh. I don't think there is any getting out of this. I don't know how I always manage to do this. 
I literally always manage to get myself stuck like this. And it's just pulling that truck towards me instead of actually getting me out. So, oh, don't tell me I'm going to have to rescue myself. I am literally going to have to rescue myself to the garage. When I'm right next to it. Okay, let's take two. Try that again. The other truck is behind me. Alright. Let's try going down this way. Maybe I won't get stuck this time. It's not going to make it over it. Oh, oh, maybe it is. Maybe it is. Maybe it isn't. Yes, no, maybe so. Come on. It's not going to do it. That was unexpected. I expected more out of this Suburban. I really did. I'm about to flip myself. It goes to about there and stops. What what in the world? I think I bottomed myself out on that log. Well, maybe I didn't. Need to get my front tires over it. There we go. Now I can pull out this way. Maybe. Needs better tires. Better tires, more traction. For sure. And I have all wheels, all wheels on and diff lock on. That's kind of pitiful that it can't even go up that. Like, it made it through the mud pretty good, but as far as, like, when it comes to real off-roading like this, it's not doing so good so far. This Suburban is turning out to be more of a fail than anything. Oh boy. And then it does stuff like this and just gets stuck, which is super lame. I don't want to give this, I don't want to give the Suburban Mall Crawler status just yet, though. I want to give it a, give it a chance. Give it a little bit of a chance. And while I work through this, I kind of want to discuss something else. Um, I saw this post the other day. I think it was a post that I saw on Facebook about spin tires, and then somebody mentioned spin tires coming to Xbox. So, I followed the link, and it was a post to, I don't know if, if any of you guys experienced, like, the spin tires glitch, where it would, like, it would, like, freeze up or something, and, like, like it would freeze up on startup, and it wouldn't start up, and then they, like, they released a temporary fix until they updated, and then they updated the game, but anyway, in the same post where the glitch was updated it was a post to a forum uh on ov ov i don't know o o v e e dot co dot uk so it's a uk it's a united kingdom website and he discusses the bug and then at the very end he discusses it the post is by zane saxton on he says at the very end that um, they have been working, quote unquote, working hard to secure a deal with a partner, and it is a great pleasure that we can now announce that spin tires will be coming to both Xbox One and PlayStation 4, expected to arrive early 2017. Now, as far as being officially confirmed, I don't know. This post, I mean, it seems pretty official. And all we can do is speculate as of right now. But if any of you guys have more information about this, definitely let me know in the comments down below. 
but that would be it would be super 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 exciting to get spin tires on Xbox now yeah there would probably be more things that you can do in the PC version but just I feel like there may be some different things you can do in Xbox and I don't know I feel like like it would be a little bit different because you'd probably have different maps or something they would probably be able to give us bigger maps and they may be able to give us a little bit more of a like a campaign and things to do other than just drive like as far as like logging and everything goes and maybe other stuff so maybe like some kind of off-roading objectives more difficult courses maybe but i would i would really like to see spin tires come to xbox it would be really cool and i definitely would buy it so if you guys want to see that comment down below and maybe they'll notice and maybe they'll make it happen for sure but like I said all we can do right now is speculate but it's I don't know the post seems hopeful the post to this website seems hopeful so maybe early 2017 we can have spin tires on Xbox Xbox and PlayStation for all you PlayStation guys Suburban got, a, as far as the Suburban goes, it got a little bit better, but it's still, there's like certain areas like this right here that I'm at right now, where it just shouldn't have a problem, but it does. Like, it should not have a problem right here. It should not have a problem at all. Nope, I need to back up further. Come on, go forward. Go forward. Oh boy. It gets damaged very easily too, and it doesn't hold a lot of damage. It gets it gets damaged easily and can't handle much, which is not a good thing. Yep, and it's stuck again. Dangerous water level? I'm not even any I'm not I mean I'm near water, but I'm not even in it or anything. Or, oh wait, that was engine damage, my bad. I'm used to the little the little bar that shows uh, dangerous water level. Oh, it did say dangerous water level. What in the world? Oh boy. That was like beyond a tripod. That was two wheels up in the air. Yep, this Suburban is not doing it for me. It is not cooperating. It is not being a good off-roader. Unfortunately, it's a nice truck, and I, I wish it worked better, but the fact of the matter is it doesn't. It's good for, like, mudding and stuff, but that's about it. <laughs> it's not really, it's not a trail rig. It's... It's definitely not a trail rig, unfortunately. But, if you guys enjoyed this video, give me a thumbs up. Comment down below what you think. If you want to see spin tires come to Xbox and PS4, comment down below that. Uh, if you're new to the channel, hit that red subscribe button down below. Thank you guys for watching.